What would happen if the Earth were actually flat? <laughs> Goodbye 2020, and welcome to the new year 2021. The Earth has yet again made a complete revolution around the Sun. But wait a sec, if you believe in the idea of a flat Earth, aka flat Earth theory, then you'd believe that the Earth never revolved around the Sun at all. For most of our history, humans believed the Earth to be flat. And today, it's almost impossible to believe the Earth is anything but round, right? But what if the flat Earth theory was actually spot on this whole entire time? How would gravity work? Would the seasons change? Would there still be different time zones? This is matter. And this is what would happen if the Earth was actually flat this entire time. Once upon a time, it made a lot of sense to our ancestors to believe that the Earth was flat. But that's probably because we didn't really understand a lot of the important key scientific discoveries to complete a full and competent scientific hypothesis yet. Right off the bat, here's an important factor that our ancestors weren't considering at the time the concept of gravity. But how does gravity really play an important role in all of this? And what if the flat earthers were right, and the earth was in fact flat regardless? Well, first of all, even if at some point in time the earth was truly flat, earth would not remain flat for a long time. A planet's gravitational pull happens equally from all sides, and will always end up forcing the planet into a sphere-like shape over a very short period of time. Gravity pulls from the center to the edges, like the spokes of a bicycle wheel. This makes the overall shape of a planet a sphere, which is a three-dimensional circle. Wait a second, though. Let's bring it back for a second and rewind. Would gravity even be possible on a flat Earth? Well, a pancaked Earth might not have any gravity at all. But if it did, the gravity would change direction as you move toward the edge. At the center, gravity would pull you just like you're on spherical Earth and would become stronger as you tried to move away from it. It would feel like a long and hard hike up a very steep hill. If you think that sounds weird, how about the serious possibility of gravity sucking all the water toward the center of the Earth? Or how trees and plants would grow diagonally, since they develop in the opposite direction of the gravity's pull? If the Earth was currently flat, it would pretty much stop rotating and there would be no geomagnetic field to protect the Earth from the harmful solar winds, and charged particles from the Sun would penetrate our atmosphere with ease. Get it? Sunbeams of death would zap us faster than you could finish a yawn. I mean, can you imagine walking outside, stopping for a quick yawn, and getting zapped by a solar flare? And that's if you had the energy to walk around in the first place. Because remember, the closer you would live to the middle of the flat Earth, the harder the gravity would pull. And that would mean that at some point during your walk toward the middle of the flat Earth, gravity would pin you down to the road, making you incapable of traveling any further. Wouldn't we have heard stories about that on the news or on social media by now? Speaking of social media, you might as well follow us on Instagram by quickly searching for at the real matter. Anyways, if the Earth suddenly turned flat, all life forms on Earth would be affected in some way. Humans would be zapped by deadly solar flare particles, causing everything from cancer to seriously damaging our DNA. And most insects would just be instantly squashed to goo. One interesting flat Earth theory places our planet at the center of the universe and states that the Sun revolves around our planet, not the other way around. The same theory states that an ice wall around the edges supposedly prevents people from falling off the edge of flat Earth. Wait, did I say people? I meant to say penguins, since they would live in the colder regions. If this theory was correct, these penguins would not only just look cute and cuddly, but they'd also be some of the bravest animals on Earth. I mean, they would have to eventually wander off the edge of the world at some point and live in constant danger, right? Penguins would wonder to themselves, Hmm, what would happen if I jumped off the side of the Earth right now? Death by Flat Earth, LOL. 
Anyways, what about the seasons? Well, flat earthers believe that the seasons are changing when the sun is closer and further from Earth and that the Earth stays in a fixed distance from the sun. So they believe in gravity, and that's good, right? No, they don't, because we just explained how that wouldn't make sense if the Earth was flat. But if the sun orbited the Earth just like our moon does, time zones wouldn't even exist, as the sun would light up pretty much the whole planet constantly since the Earth would be completely flat in this theory. There would be no day and night cycles, seasons, solar eclipses, and many other phenomena like world-famous auroras. In a flat world, satellites wouldn't be possible. I mean, how on flat Earth would they orbit a freaking plane, right? LOL. That means no GPS, no ATM machines, no stock market transactions, no mobile phones, and worst of all, no Wi-Fi. We'd be so very bored without internet. But hey, look on the bright side. If the Earth was truly flat, with a pair of binoculars, you could see Mount Everest, the Great Pyramids of Giza, and the Eiffel Tower from any part of the flat world. Pretty cool, huh? Who would need Wi-Fi then? Just order a pair of binoculars on Amazon Prime? Wait, never mind, not possible on flat Earth. Anyways, the notion of a flat Earth is gaining traction, and some people actually really do believe in it. Most of science says no, but hey, Science is always evolving, right? Maybe the Earth is truly flat, and everything we brought up in this video gets scientifically disproven tomorrow. That's the beauty of science. What we know today could completely change tomorrow. But if you thought the flat Earth theory was the craziest conspiracy you've ever heard of, think again. Have you heard of the hollow Earth theory? Well, we'll leave that story for another episode of Matter. What are some of your favorite science theories? We'd love to know. If you had fun learning something today, be sure to subscribe to our family and make sure to smash the like button and click the bell icon to get new updates. We may not be the largest channel around, but I bet we care about each and every one of our subscribers more than anyone else around. I want to know your thoughts on flat earth theory. Please let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Until next time.